Welcome to an world exclusive first look of the new Audi A3 sedan. And look at it, it has the typical Audi face with the large single frame grille right here. And then it has digital daytime running lights, which look really nice, I think. And also those inserts here in secondary color. It gives the whole car a really sporty look and that goes on on the side. I mean, you see the negative curvature, that's a world first for the Audi A3. And that is in contrast to the flared Quattro blisters. And also, then it is a sedan, so you have quite a big boot that you can open with your feet. So as you can see, there's quite a lot of space in the boot, but now let's check out the interior. So of course, this is an all new cockpit, but it looks really nice, has premium materials everywhere. And there's a large 12.3 inch virtual cockpit plus that you can set to your own preferences. It has a sporty and dynamic layout and you can set everything you want there. For example, your music or a large map of your navigation. Another thing I really like is you have wireless phone charging right here and then also two USB-C ports. So you're really set for the future. What now comes standard on all A3 is this large touchscreen here that has acoustic feedback and inside is MIB3. That's the new modular infotainment system and it's really easy to use. It's just like on your smartphone and for example, you can go onto navigation and then go to search and you can now use handwriting. That's really nice. For example, I just put down I and N and of course it got it, I N for Ingolstadt. And with this, you can put in your whole address. Or for example, go back to music and play something. And with that, let's go down here because this new round element, that's your new sensory volume regulator. So you just slide your finger in a circular motion and that controls the volume. Or go left or right to put on the new track. So those are all nice features, but I also just like the new layout of the middle console and the whole interior. I mean, look at the air vents and those large screens right here. And the design language doesn't just stop in the middle, but we also have new, really extravagant door handles. So the interior really feels like an Audi, the outside looks like an Audi, but does it also behave like an Audi? Let's check it out. So right off the bat, the first thing that I see, that I feel is, wow, this is premium. I mean, we are in a compact class car. Everything is really focused to the driver. You have the virtual cockpit plus, you have the air vents going directly at you. Just, it just looks nice. And the new thing that is standard now on the Audi A3 is the pedals. So you have pedals to shift up or down right here in front of you and you can use them really easily. One feature I really like is the head-up display. It's right in front of me. It's like a virtual image on the street and I don't have to take my eyes off the road to see the speed that I'm at and also the speed limit. You can now order the A3 with a mild hybrid, so that means less emissions and also better efficiency. Okay, I think I can confirm this car really behaves like an Audi and I'd like to drive some more. 